Hey Libra, what's up? Welcome to your monthly reading for mid-month May 2022. Keep in mind that these are general messages, so they may or may not resonate. If they don't, do check out your rising moon and Venus placements. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter and Facebook. And if you want to book a person reading with me, then links for all of that is in the description box below. Please remember, energy is fluid and rules can be reversed, okay? Alright, so let's jump into your reading, Libra. <clears throat> okay, please show me messages for Libra. What does the Libra needs to know? Messages for Libra. What does Libra needs to know? <clears throat> okay, what does Libra needs to know? Libra, we have unlikely, right? So I feel this is um, the answer to your question. Whatever you've been contemplating over or whatever question is on your mind regarding maybe a relationship or you know, regarding your business or career or some other situation or some other aspect in your life right now that you're dealing with or going through. So the answer is unlikely, right? So whatever you've been thinking about, it's unlikely to happen, right? Now it can be a positive thing or it can be a negative thing, right? So it's up to you um, to take this however it resonates. But then, you know, the answer is unlikely. The angels want you to know that <clears throat> it's unlikely. <laughs> okay, and then we have um, peaceful resolution, right? So with these two cards together, if you read them, I feel that you are stressing about some situation in your life, right? Something you're thinking about and you're, um, I feel you're just kind of, you know, uh, tensed or maybe you're thinking too much in your head like you know things are not going to turn out in your favor or maybe there is some situation or some person um, that you're dealing with and you feel that this won't go right down the line right maybe um, you know things are not going to work out in your favor or there's some sort of a conflict or dispute that you're facing so this is the message for you Libra that you need to know that angels are telling you that you know it's unlikely that things are not going to be in your favor, right? There's going to be peaceful resolution. Everything is going to turn out in your favor. Things are going to settle down peacefully. There's going to be like, you know, no conflict or um, things are going to, you know, work out smoothly for you. So you ne need not stress over uh, whatever you've been stressing about Libra, right? There's going to be peaceful resolution to whatever problem or situation you feel stuck in. And it's unlikely that things are not going to go in your favor, right? It's unlikely. So be positive, stay positive, have faith and belief that angels are working on your behalf and uh, there's going to be peaceful resolution, right? Yes. Okay. So let's see what fortune cookie messages are for you, Libra. <clears throat> okay, please show me fortune cookie messages for Libra. cookie messages for Libra please all right we have travel uh, long distance communication will open up your life exciting experiences for singles and career advancement for others so lots of traveling coming up for you Libra right you could be traveling to some uh, long distance uh, you know maybe some far away country or to some other location some somewhere where you need to travel by air or maybe water i don't know but i feel there's there's some sort of a travel that's coming up for you right and it's like um communication you know communication is it's, it's more like the eight of wands of the tarot right so yeah so communication is coming up there's, there's some sort of um lines of communication could be opening up with some person here right and exciting experiences are for singles for those of you who are single someone new could be entering your life maybe you could meet this person while traveling 
um, right and uh, for others of you I feel some sort of a good news is coming your way in your career maybe for some of you you are you are um, changing locations you are you're you having some long distance uh, project you know maybe you are working you know or maybe you just switching up career or some some sort of a job and you know going to some other country and taking up a new job so a lot of excitement is in the air with lots of communication right so yeah so so things are going to be you know don't don't be stressed over about um, things like how they're going to go or if there's going to be peaceful resolution or not because i see lots of um, you know positive things happening for you right all right so let's see what the tarot has to say please show me some messages for libra what does the libra needs to know present energy for libra please show me the present energy for libra what does the libra needs to know what's currently going on with libra nine of pentacles so i feel libra you're doing really good you know your focus right now is on yourself your finances you're very much focused on your career and you know yeah for some of you i feel you're just kind of following your own tune right you're you're just kind of uh, doing your own thing right now and 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 for all of you i see some 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 sort of a good news coming your way with the judgment card definitely uh, i feel you're also traveling to some place right uh, where you see uh, yourself growing there's there's a lot of growth and a lot of financial success is there for you so i feel for a lot of you you're taking some sort of a call here right and nine of swords also fell out so yeah so i feel um, something unexpected coming your way right something unexpected is happening something out of the blue like there is there is some sort of uh, news that just uh you know some sort of a communication came your way or is about to come your way for some of you i feel it's yet to come your way but then this is going to change your life this is this is going to be a you know a life changing moment for you when this communication this person this news letter or some sort of um something you're waiting for to arrive your way right some sort of a communication maybe you've applied for some interview or some some job application and you know you're waiting for some sort of a good news to come your way so yeah so i feel this is this is this is what is happening for you and it's it's going to be like life changing moment for you because i see the, uh, you're taking a huge call here right you're taking a huge decision and it's like um, just the advice for you is not to be impulsive right libra take your time don't try to uh, be impulsive or rush into anything because i see uh, you you here you want to be impulsive and you know you you quickly want to take action uh, towards whatever you you deciding to do but then um, the advice for you is to slow it down okay don't be in a rush take your time because you're realizing a lot of things here libra right you're realizing a lot of things for a lot of you 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 have realized that you want to be single for now and you want to focus on your finances and for a lot of you i see a lot of abundance is coming towards you career wise you're well settled you look good your money looks perfect and you're taking time out to um, you know on your on your own um, growth and development right you're you're taking time out to indulge in self care you just kind of maybe for some of you you're taking time off from social media and trying to you know just be by yourself with a glass of wine or maybe you know trying to up level yourself yourself in some way and this has been like hit you hard right this has been a realization that's hit that's hit you hard and you know off late you're like you realize that no you can't always uh, be jumping on to the next thing you need to take some time off and you need to put in a lot of uh, effort in in yourself as well right you, mentally emotionally spiritually you have to take time out for yourself and and care for yourself and that's what you've realized right libra and that's how you attract abundance towards you so this is like a like a huge call a great decision i mean a big decision that you're taking and for some of you it's like uh maybe travel could be also involved here maybe for some of you you've you've decided to you know um change location and you're traveling to some place else you're moving uh, to some other country maybe but then i see that yeah for some of you you could be also you know 
air traveling uh, like maybe just flying to somewhere someplace else uh, and for those of you I feel that you've been waiting um, to, to take a call uh, or you know you've been waiting to make a decision for a very long time but then you've been waiting you, you had been waiting for this um, you know news to arrive your way some sort of a communication and that's coming your way right and you're like you're just chilling right now you're chill chilled out you're you're feeling all self-confident your self-esteem is high you're just you're kind of focusing on yourself you look good so yeah so that's a beautiful thing Libra a lot of lot of good things happening for you and that's because you have uh, you know put in a lot of effort you've you've done a lot of work on yourself right and you've kind of um, realized a lot of things so there's there's some sort of a rebirth or renewal of some sort of uh, you know um, in, in, in one aspect of your life it's happening for you and you, you have realized that you need to take time out to nurture yourself to care for yourself and yeah and that's leading to a lot of uh, unexpected things in your life right some sort of a news or some sort of a communication is coming your way so be prepared for it Libra if it hasn't happened yet it's gonna happen soon okay uh, all right so we have the knight of uh, wands as well so yes again uh, this is again talks about travel so I feel that I don't know why Libra but you're feeling very ambitious right you're you're it's like you're you're up for some sort of an adventure and you it's like there's there's no stopping you right it's like you've been waiting for this news to come your way and then you're zooming off you're 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 traveling yeah you're preparing yourself for some sort of a travel here lots of um, lots of uh, things are happening in your life right now libra okay maybe um, i don't know but for some of you i feel this could be also a person entering your life right but this is uh, just be careful because this person could be impulsive this this person could be a little um, you know just physically attracted to you because right now you look so good and they know you're single you're single you're enjoying your life you you're attracting abundance towards you and of course a lot of admirers as well uh, i also see some you know for some of you uh, there are two options in love coming your way because you're single and uh, these two people could be coming your way right one could be an air sign gemini libra aquarius and one could be a fire sign um um saji leo aries right so yeah okay then we have the death card so definitely some sort of a rebirth like i said it's happening for you um Lib uh, libra and yeah i mean you're just you know you kind of done with the past that's what i feel you you kind of with the with the judgment card and the death card i feel there's some sort of a renewal and rebirth that's happening for you you you're putting an end to a lot of things um, from your past that didn't uh, you know serve your highest higher good right that's that's not serving you anymore and you want to just move on so for a lot of you you're you're closing out relationships you're ending um, situations things and people cutting off people from your life who are not in alignment to what you are becoming uh, you know your your next version they are not in alignment so you're kind of letting go you're cutting the past and you're moving on so for a lot of you i see some sort of an ending and has happened in your life recently this could be again it could be just about you right you being single or maybe some some sort of an ending regarding a relationship um you know someone just entered and quickly left from your life probably this person was super attracted to you but then you know nothing stable or solid was there uh, for, uh they had to offer you right but then uh, you know now you're single and you've kind of ended a lot of things in your life you're this is like a transformation that you're going through libra right and you have shifted your focus on your finances your career it's sort of an awakening moment for you right so yeah four of pentacles and we have the three of cups right so i feel now libra you're kind of become guarded with your feelings you're way cautious even in social situations like you know even in when it comes to partying with your friends or when it comes to selecting your friends you've become very 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 cautious right you're you're guarding your uh, resources you're guarding your heart and it's like um, 
it's like you're not you're, you you haven't become anti social but then you know you just want to right now you just want to spend time with yourself you don't want to open up yourself to anyone beat beat even your friends but i feel that you've kind of isolated yourself but then don't do that libra because socializing is what you need i see for some of you some sort of a social event is coming up maybe a friends you reunion or a family get together or just like you know your friends could be asking you to go out and have fun with them but then you are kind of um, apprehensive you're skeptical and you just you're just not in the mood to go out and party right because you 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 are you are going through so much of a you know transitional phase in your life you're going through so much of a change that your friends also don't see it but then you don't want to you know spend your time out going out with, with friends and you know you're kind of right now you just being very cautious and you are like you know just want to spend time with yourself right now that's what i feel here libra <clears throat> okay what else for libra what happened in the recent past for libra okay we have the um knight of cups and the star card so in the recent past i feel there was some sort of a uh, romantic offer that came your way right libra someone had romantic feelings for you and this could be the person uh, you you had been manifesting with the star card here your, or your hopes and uh, wishes you felt like it was it was being fulfilled you know this person really sweep you off your feet and you know they made you um like they put you up on a pedestal and they made you s s feel so much loved and they had so much love uh, for you in their heart libra could be a can a cancer scorpio pisces or an aquarius right uh but yeah in the recent past i see someone offering you love right and it was like a beautiful romantic dreamy period for you yeah you felt very hopeful you felt like it was destiny you you both were uh you know destined to meet each other again you could have met this person while traveling so we have the three knights here right knight of swords knight of wands and knight of cups so yeah so you could also be dealing with multiple people libra let's be honest here right you had your options open you were manifesting someone um and you know there were multiple people that came your way right but i think there has been some sort of an ending in your life recently with one of these people or there could be some more options coming your way as well right so just take however it may resonate libra all right so what else for libra okay we have page of cups and we have the four of cups yes so definitely libra i think um someone had feelings for you right and you know you you i don't know but then you know i feel you are not interested in love this could be your energy four of cups libra right someone had feelings for you maybe you also had feelings for them but then it's like you don't want to open yourself up to any new energy or any new person coming your way right you see how this 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 boy is getting this uh cup for this person but he's not interested he's looking at those empty cups in front of him right so you could be your focus libra could be on the past right now you're just trying to process a lot of uh maybe past failed relationships or you're trying to you know um open yourself up or you know trying to work on your heart chakra but then you're not interested in love right now but there is someone i see here in your energy space who wants to express their emotions to you right this person has feelings for you could be again could be the same person as the knight of cups here right so yeah again a water sign cancer scorpio pisces so this person has feelings for you and i feel they they're soon going to reach out and express their emotions to you if they haven't yet but i feel that you are just not interested because you're very much stuck in the past right but then uh, libra this is someone you had manifested so yeah if you had manifested this person then why are you so much fucked up in your head <laughs> ah okay so tell me more like what's what does libra needs to know any more messages for libra i feel you have multiple options in love libra you have lot of people eyeing you 
right because they are attracted to you because they know you are single but then you are not willing to open yourself up to these these energies you don't even want to go out and socialize forget about love <laughs> okay we have the page of wands so i feel yeah um i think you're kind of um there libra there is definitely someone who is su who is super attracted to you and they you know they want to communicate with you they want to express their feelings for you they want to tell you that how much they are um you know attracted to you they feel like a kid at heart and they're enthusiastic and you know so much of excitement is in the air for this person they really you know they're they're eyeing you and they want to come out and express and open their open the lines of communication with you but i see that you are just keeping them at a distance i don't know why but you are keeping them at a distance here there is something that you worried about libra right maybe you worried that what if someone breaks your heart and all of that but then let me tell you that it's it's not going to happen it's unlikely it's unlikely and everything is going to turn out beautifully it's going to be there's going to be a peaceful resolution but then you have to believe it libra you just can't sit all by yourself and do nothing right and then expect universe to work for you no it doesn't happen like that because i see here there is someone who wants to flirt with you page of cups page of wands they are physically super attracted to you right they have an offer of love and they want to offer you their cup of love and this is someone that you had manifested they are dreaming about you you are dreaming about them right but then you want to be single why i don't know okay 10 of pentacles so yeah so this person you know one of these energies they they have um commitment and marriage on their minds right so yes so you could be like you know having a family with them okay because 10 of pentacles is like it talks about marriage and of course with the 9 and 10 of pentacles libra i feel also your focus is definitely on on money right now and and huge amount of money is coming towards you so your money is is it looks good superb and there's a lot of abundance and a lot of prosperity and wealth that's coming for you but then i feel there is also someone here who wants to offer you that uh, long term commitment and stability give you a secure family life you know they they the dream of having a family with you so yes someone has commitment on their minds libra and they're going to soon reach out to you and confess their feelings for you but then you are not open to it right okay what are the blockages here for libra what are the blockages for libra please show me the blockages for libra okay eight of pentacles yeah your focus is very much on finances right now finances and career and you're kind of trying to you know end things the past you're you're trying to close out a cycle you're trying to you know like i said putting a lot of uh, in end to a lot of things from your past so you've completed a cycle here there's some some sort of a completion for a lot of you i feel you had been working on a project uh, for a very long time some sort of uh, you know an endeavor regarding your career or you know at your workplace you had been busy working on a project so that's why you didn't have time for it, for love right uh, and now that project has come to a completion so that could be a blockage right because you were so much focused on your finances or maybe you still are kind of you know very much focused on finances your career you you you're working your ass off and probably for a lot of you you don't have time for love i feel that's that that could be an, another another blockage that you do, just don't have time for love because you're so busy at work right so yeah but then a lot of ending is happening for you i feel you just kind of uh, putting a lot of things with a death card the world card and the judgment you realizing that you know it's like you 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 need to ascend to a higher level right too much too much focus on money but like you like right now your focus is on finances but i see like a lot of people eyeing you and a lot of people wishing to be with you they are attracted to your energy a lot of proposal offers love offers coming your way libra so be prepared okay but you have recently transformed yourself and you have ended a lot of things a lot of relationships in your life right now you know your self worth and self value you've done your inner work and it's it's showing showing off nine of cups again yeah you you're self sufficient libra you just don't need anyone to be with you you look so happy alone 
you're in your own dream world building castles in the air probably you know you're thinking about how to earn more money but then you, you, you just you look so good but then you're also you know manifesting so what are you manifesting Libra if there is someone um, you know some some lover that you're manifesting then be rest assured that it, this person is coming your way with love with, lo with a love offer and all your wishes are going to be fulfilled right yes uh, okay, so what's the advice? Please show me the advice for Libra. Advice for Libra, please. What is the advice for Libra? The Emperor. Yeah, so advice for you is to Libra. Take charge and control of your life, right? And um, yeah, be... I mean, I don't know, but the emperor is like someone who's who has a lot of authority and a lot of power, right? So this person is like disciplined and he's got a lot of structure and order in his life and he's someone who likes to lead, right? So this is the energy of the emperor. So I feel maybe you're putting, you're, you're trying to lead, uh, I mean, do a lot of things, you know, trying to be in your masculine energy. So advice for you is to be like, you know, take, take charge and, you uh, know, and bring a little bit of discipline in your life discipline is what you need right libra so uh, yeah authority discipline and then in the bottom of the deck i have the nine of wands right so yeah so advice for you is also to let your guard down don't be so defensive don't be like you know like you can do it all sort of a thing that's that's the advice for you don't be so much in your masculine energy that you block uh, you know block out all uh, whatever wants to come your way and whoever wants to come your way right so yeah so stop being so defensive so that's the advice for you okay let's see some love messages i also feel libra you are gonna find your lover or maybe you know people uh, who want to express their love to you or multiple offers of love coming your way only if you go out and socialize because i see that this person could be from your social circle yeah for a lot of you right this person could be from your social circle so keep that in mind and go out and socialize okay don't be a homebody or don't try to isolate yourself okay love messages for Libra please what are the love messages for Libra oh, love messages for Libra Also, for a lot of you, you could be traveling with the world card and then you're going to meet your lover, right? So some sort of a social event while traveling or something like that is coming towards you. This person is coming towards you with uh, communication, right? They're going to communicate because we have the page of wands and the page of cups. So two communication cards here. Libra, be prepared. A lot of love offers are coming your way, right? And this would only happen while you're out socializing or while you're out traveling to some other country or some, some place. And this person is gonna reach out to you right and don't stress about anything because whatever you're stressing about it's unlikely that it's gonna happen right there's gonna be peaceful resolution career looks superb right and i think you're single so yeah so a lot of love offers coming your way so messages for you in love past life relationship you have known each other before so i feel this person that i'm talking about that's coming towards you with love offer i think this is gonna be this is someone from your past and also we have the mercury retrograde going on so i feel a lot of past life relationships um, you know people come back in your life right getting to know each other as you reveal your innermost selves to each other your bond deepens so the advice for you is to get to know each other libra okay don't push this person away worth waiting for divine timing is at work in your love life so if you're waiting for someone and you're manifesting that's what i see here then definitely it's worth waiting for and this could be the one you've already met the romantic partner you seek for some of you you've already met this person right they're in your energy space so yeah libra open yourself up to these energies okay a lot of people want to come towards you but only if you are receptive to these energies right so that was your reading libra for mid-month may uh, i hope you enjoyed this and i hope it resonated with most of you all of you if it did please do like share and subscribe thank you so much for watching